A swimmer rescued today in Atlantic Beach after being reported missing at Jacksonville Beach. Ocean Rescue says it's possible they were caught in dangerous conditions out in the water. News for Jack's reporter Marilyn Parker joins us live at Atlantic Beach, Maryland. It took hours to find the swimmer. It did, and Jack's Beach Rescue says the re swimmer was reported missing at North Jack's Beach, and just about a two hours later, they found him, them right here at Atlantic Beach. That's about four miles apart from where I'm standing, and I'm told crews searched by land, water, and air to find them. Ocean Rescue says it was around 9 a.m. when a family member reported the swimmer missing. It wasn't until 11 a.m. when crews spotted the swimmer gave them CPR and turned them over to Jack's Fire Rescue. We haven't gotten an update on their condition at this time, but we were previously told they were in serious condition. Out on the water, high surf and very rough waves today. Lifeguards say they've been warning beachgoers and encouraging them not to go too far out into the water. I spoke to a captain with Ocean Rescue who says people should keep in mind it's late in the season, so they only have a few lifeguards out. While lifeguards do take preventative measures warning people about the rip currents, the captain tells me it's better to stay in their line of sight. If you've got a lifeguard within a, a few yards, then a lifeguard can get there very quickly. If a, if a lifeguard's half a mile away, they're probably not going to be able to see you and it's going to take a lot longer for us to get there. Someone else is going to have to recognize it and report it. And by then it's getting a little late in the game already. So if you're in front of a lifeguard that's on duty, they can recognize and react and respond quickly and call for extra help. It's after hours now, so the lifeguard towers have come down. But how do you know if a tower is being manned by a lifeguard? Well, this one is not exactly the tower, but it'll do for now. Sometimes pedestrians like to get on these towers after hours, but typically if you see lifeguard equipment or buoys or an orange flag, that means the tower is being manned by a lifeguard. We're live at Atlantic Beach tonight. Marilyn Parker, Channel 4, the local station.